Hello, officers, Scorpio, and welcome now to Wednesday. Thanks for logging in. Overcast and a bit spaced out. Feeling blasé is my opinion today for the Scorpions. That's because the moon has now moved into your subconscious. That means you'll be emotionally focused on subconscious emotions. How's that work? Well, this is a day where you get triggered. Triggered by the past, triggered by exes, triggered by old memories. Basically, these are the weeds in your soul garden, and the moon will cross over Saturn in the next 24 hours, which means somewhere in your emotional matrix, and as it applies to your old karma, somewhere in that karma, you're going to have to grow up emotionally just a little bit. So this may be the emotional expectation of something to happen. So you may fall into one of those things like, why me? Why am I always the one, last one to get their paycheck on the Friday? And that might not just be you upset about a paycheck on Friday or whatever. That may be you upset that always feeling that you're the last to, uh, to get, you're the last person to get something in life. And why is that? And where'd that start? And hello, that's called a weed in your soul garden. Probably started back from your childhood where mom fed you last. That's kind of how that stuff starts. But either way, just realize you are a bit mm, triggerable today. And somewhere, when it comes to your expectations of the past or of the present, or if you're projecting the past onto the present, you have to grow up, just like all of us, just a little bit. So around the sun, we are in chapter two of Sun and Capricorn. Today, Neptune is ruling the day, so you're more naturally inclined to understand that subconscious weed uh, matrix, by the way, than usual. Great day to meditate. Now, the big topic for you is your attitude. Attitude issues. Scorpios are trying to get a new attitude on life this month, and now if you're kind of confused how to do that or how to escape your current one, Meditate on it. Ask your higher self or your guardian agents up there. Then Jupiter, I want to point out, Jupiter will be moving into Pisces in two weeks. In fact, it's telling us astrologers it is time to act on the Jupiter Aquarius fortune. By the way, for the last year, Scorpios have been working on expanding their potting soil. How grounded you are, how well you take care of yourself, how much you eat or don't eat, what your family politics are, your reactions to early childhood, leaving, letting that go, hopefully. And now whatever you've developed as potting soil, as your foundation, Act on it now. Go ahead and act on it somehow. Do something out of that potting soil. Then Skip Jennings goes live today with a new episode of Urban Mystic. His topic today is discipline and how to navigate to your own discipline within you. So if you don't feel very disciplined, check out Skip. He's got all the answers. And tonight, DJ David Palmer live with Astro Mingo. He'll be live 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, streaming over the web, spinning records, talking astrology, and I'll be on camera and in chat room answering your questions as well. All right, Scorpio, that's all I have for hump day. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So